Cancer Council researchers have been working with the WHO to support the launch of the major strategic plan for cervical cancer elimination, which is being launched today. I think we can be very proud as Australians that we were in fact the first country in the world to attempt a mass vaccination program with HPV vaccine. The impact of this globally is that we can now demonstrate to the world at large how effective the vaccines actually are because the burden of disease caused by these papillomaviruses in Australia has just disappeared over the course of the last 10 years. I'm grateful for the Australian HPV vaccination program as it means cervical cancer will be eliminated in my lifetime. These tests are more sensitive for the detection of precancerous abnormalities and therefore more effective. I'm grateful that I've had the HPV vaccine this year because it's one less thing for me to worry about when I'm older. Elimination is possible for Aboriginal and Torres Strait Islander women, but it requires concerted efforts from all sectors of the health system to address long-standing and known structural barriers. I'm a Gariata woman from the Pilbara. I had my screening test and it saved my life. I feel that more people will not have to go through what I went through, which was having cancer. So yeah, I feel really lucky that that test existed. If countries can successfully scale up to the WHO 2030 targets, then we have predicted that 300,000 women's lives will be saved in the next decade alone, and 62 million lives will be saved over the course of the century.